Through and through, 25 yards. Yeah, he's dead dead. I saw, I saw his legs going up. Yeah. Alright, so he was standing behind that one? Or th th this uh, one? I think it was... You shot him there, it had to be that one. That one? I think he was in here somewhere. Yeah, I see him over there. He's down. I think he was right in here. I was just looking for the arrow. Blood. Blood. I think the arrow went right through. That's when he got through and through. I must have still in him. Yeah. Oh, here it is. Oh. Caked in blood. Yeah. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Through and through. 25 yards. Oh. Look at those rides. Ain't that bad. Yeah. You think that's heart? It's super bloody. Or you know. <laughs> A little high. Oh, dude. He's not small. No. Fork. Yeah. Well, three by three. It is three by three. <laughs> nice, dude. Yeah. Hell yeah. That other one looked big. I was gonna get him, but he did. He didn't really stop, and then when I did see him, he was darting. Yeah. I was like, yeah, his buddy just died. So. Oh, look at that. That's weird. Yeah, I saw that when you picked him up. Good size deer. That's entry? No, that's lung. Yeah, it's entry, yeah. Uh, yeah, you can see the bubbling. Yeah. That's entry. Park's gonna be untouched. Yeah, a little high. I was going for here. Well, shit. Yeah, now we have a lot of work to do now. That just escalated. Yeah. Um, I'm just feeling like we were going to have to stash them somewhere. Like get them, because we're probably going to have to quarter them out and not do the skinning shit in the morning. Yeah. See, that's what, that's why they look different color. He was about to be gray, but he's got that mm -hmm. brown hair. He's still got the rest of his summer coat on. Dang, that's a pretty good entry wound. Yeah, those rage, that rage did what it was supposed to. You look at that cut hole, that cut, that, uh -huh. there's a hole. There, baby. I think worked to perfection. Yeah. It just blasted right through him. Well, um, do you want to get pictures? Yeah. Real quick. Just tagged out. Archery deer. My first archery deer. We're out here uh, elk hunting. And we just bugled. And we're kind of looking around. Trying to see if we hear anything, you know. Just looking with our ears kind of thing. And I turned to my left. Like 25 yards, standing there broadside. There was a tree in front of him. And so I'm like, Billy, don't move. Billy, don't move. And uh, I'm like, range him. So Billy pulls out and ranges him for him while I'm getting knocked and getting an arrow in. And then the, there was a tree right behind us that was in the way. And uh, so I, I was like, what should I do, Bill? And he's like, draw back first. So I drew back first and then two steps to the right and then just put it on him and you could hear the pop of that thing going through just clean straight through the deer and he went 20 yards yeah 20 maximum yeah 20 yards and he was upside down kicking so and then there was another really nice three by something it was probably a four by four yeah, with eye guards uh and he he was right behind him i didn't see him until after i shot this guy and he took off this other big buck. We should have thought about it, you know? Yeah. Because we always see him in Paris right yeah. now. Yeah, right now we have been. 
every, yeah. day, every time we've seen it. Yeah. Yeah, man. That's freaking rad. So now, we weren't even expecting to shoot deer. Um, but I'm, I'm going to miss, like, the first two weeks of deer season that we usually do. So um, we were just talking about if I, if I see one, get a good, you know, good shot. Uh, so this is my second biggest 3x3, three three, second biggest buck. Because I had the 4x2, three 3x3, two, three three, and then two forks. Yeah. So, but uh, we had a lot of shit to do today, midday shenanigan-wise. What are you thinking? I think we need to get this guy gutted quickly. Yeah. Get him in bags and get him in the You want to quarter him up? I think we should. Yeah. Maybe just quarter them and hang them in a tree. Yeah.